Hey, hello everyone. My name is Sumit Bhardwaj and in this video, I am going to talk about how success leaves clues and how we can follow those clues to be super successful. One of the great things about living in today's world of abundance and opportunity is that almost everything that we want to do has already been done by somebody else. It doesn't matter whether it's losing weight, running a marathon, starting a business, becoming a millionaire, defeating any kind of illness or disease, or hosting a perfect dinner party. Somewhere, somebody has already done it and has left clues in the form of videos, audios, in the form of workshops, seminars, or in the form of online courses. Let's take one example. If you want to retire as a millionaire, for instance, there are hundreds and thousands of books on that. There are resources on how to start your own business, becoming a super salesperson, and even marketing on the internet. If you want to have a better relationship with your spouse, there are books on that too. For virtually everything you want to do, there are books and courses on how to do it. Better yet, just a phone call away are the people who have already successfully done what you want to do and were available as teachers, facilitators, mentors, advisors, coaches and consultants. When you take advantage of this information, you will discover that life is simply a connect the dots game and all the dots have already been identified and organized by somebody else. All we have to do is follow the blueprint use the system and work the program that they provide. Now, let me tell you why we do not see the success clues. Number one, it never occurs to us. We don't see others using these resources, so we don't do it either. Our parents didn't do it, our friends aren't doing it. Nobody where we work is actually working on that. The other reason is it's pretty inconvenient. We'll have to go to the bookstore, library or a local college. Then we'll have to drive across the town to a meeting. We'll have to take out time away from television, family, friends and most importantly, our mobile phone. It is really, really inconvenient for us. Another reason is asking others for advice or information puts up against our fear of rejection. We are afraid to take that risk. Another reason is connecting the dots in a new way would mean change and change even when it is in our interest. It is really uncomfortable and we don't like to get uncomfortable. Connecting the dots means hard work and frankly, most people do not want to work that hard. I tell you three ways that you can use to begin to seek out clues. Number one, you can find a teacher, a coach, a mentor, a manual, a book, an audio program or an internet resource to help you achieve one of your major goals. Another thing that you can do is you can seek out someone who has already done what you wish to do and ask the person if you can interview him for an hour on how you should best proceed. The third one is really, really important. You can ask someone if you can shadow them for a day and watch them work or offer to be a volunteer, assistant or in turn for someone you think you can learn from. These three clues will definitely help you succeed in your life. Follow them. All the best.